Welcome everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can remove this background by selecting the subject. Okay. So basically it's a very simple, simple tutorial about how you can select the hairs and remove the backgrounds. So this is a very simple process, a very easy one. Uh, if you are using a very old version of Photoshop, you might not have this feature, but the latest Photoshop versions have this uh, feature. Especially if you're using CC, it's already there. So, okay. So let's get started. First of all, open this image, whichever image you want to um, edit. So first of all, uh, you can duplicate the layer by pressing Ctrl and J. After that, let's go to Select menu here. Select and there's an option called Select and Mask. Click there. So after that, you can see this kind of red thing and here up there you can see select subject click there once you click there you will see that it selects the subject so you can see that the lady has been selected but the background is not so if we zoom it it's pretty good but it still uh, it still can be improved so to do that we can go to this refine hair click on refine hair so it will do the selection uh, it, it will give a better result so that's what we want and here on these options uh, there's a view mode if you click here there are different view modes you can check with any one of them the, the overlay one is by default selected and that's I think the best mode to see what's going on if you click on black you can see the um, background is black and on white the background is white black and white is the selection only the selection it doesn't show the actual picture and if you click on layer it will show the layer below okay so for now keep it on overlay so as we can see that there the hair has been selected pretty well if you're not uh, happy with the selection of the hair Go to this left side, you can see this, the second brush is called Refine Edge Brush Tool. So click on that and increase the size of the brush. Okay, and just click like this and click like this. This, okay, on the hair. And it will select the hair better okay select the hair properly just the edge edges okay so once you are happy with the selection you can click OK and before that you can say scroll it all the way down and the output to option is selection but we need to go to new layer with their mask okay or you can keep it on selection because we already have the duplicate image so let's keep it on selection if you don't have uh, another layer the duplicate layer you have to select new layer with layer mask okay click OK Now you can click on this thing, add layer mask. 
So if you now click on this background layer, you can see that the background has been gone. So click on the background layer and click on this plus icon, create a new layer. And we will select from this left side, uh, we can select a color, click OK, and then click Alt and Backspace. And this creates a background color. And if you see the image, the color of the image or the brightness of the image, you can see that you can recognize that it's shot outside. It has the outdoor light. So it should be a little brighter color. And we can change the brightness of the color, but what we can do for a better result is go to this color picker again and pick a brighter color. Okay, click OK, and then we can go to this gradient tool and choose this the second one from the basics click and then drag from the left top towards the right bottom okay this would be better okay so now we can see that this has a very good looking background to make it a little a little brighter we can go to image adjustment go to brightness and increase the brightness okay click OK now it looks better so the original original image is this one and the one we have created is this one so this is how you select the hair of a subject of a person and um, remove the background okay so i hope you like this video if you like the video don't forget to hit the like uh, the like button uh, leave a comment and do not forget to subscribe to this channel